Hey guys, what's up? This is Phil. This is a quick troubleshooting video. If you guys have problems with connecting your Oculus Quest 2 via USB-C cable to your PC, and the quick answer is actually, if you guys do not get this prompt in the headset that asks you whether or not the PC wants to access the headset's files, um, that's usually the first area that you guys want to check. Um, so in this instance, it's doing that, but I want to point out that the areas where you could be encountering the issue if it doesn't connect via USB-C cable is the cable itself could be the issue. Um, along with the connector to the cable, the port to the headset, and then the port to the computer. Um, in this instance right here, I have a Jetson Nano connected uh, via USB-B. Now, one of the ways to be able to resolve this issue is either changing the cable, but in some instances, you might just have uh, some dust, you know, collect inside the port of the headset, and you're not getting that prompt um, in the Oculus Quest 2 that the external uh, hardware like a PC is trying to connect to the headset itself. So making sure that the connection to the headset is secure is one way to resolve that issue and the other way like I said is to make sure that the inside of the ports are clean but uh, if those things don't work and uh, you do encounter the issue that it's not connecting then maybe it uh, it's the cable itself so it's important to to also identify that um, these ports it's it's possibly not the best port in regards to you know, staying secure, uh, but it's essentially a single point of failure. And um, many times, at least if I am playing or using applications, you know, connecting the headset to the PC, I will secure the cable uh, to to the head strap here. So at least uh, there is one preventive measure um, from preventing, uh, you know, the connector from breaking or, or losing connection. Because like I said, it's not the most secure location and uh, if you notice too, it's, it's on a slight curve, so it's not, it's not fully jacked in when uh, the cable is connected. But uh, that's all I got for the video, guys. Hopefully it helped with this issue. Maybe, you helped, uh, maybe it'll help resolve the issue. Um, there could be other things, but uh, like I said, the first area to check, in my opinion, is the connection itself if you guys are running into issues. So just a recap, uh, the problem could be the cable itself, the connector to the cable, the port, and the port on the other end of, of the cable or the port itself. So, um, and the first, the first thing that you do want to check is to make sure that the headset does prompt you um, that some external source is trying to connect to the headset. And that's all I got, guys. Uh, you have to excuse the mess because I got a lot of things going on. But uh, hopefully this helps, and if uh, you guys have any additional questions, let me know. Um, and this was something that actually that popped up numerous times on Reddit, and uh, uh, I figured it was important to be able to let people know, or at least to give people uh, a potential solution to this issue. You guys have a wonderful day, and take it easy.